going on YouTube? It's your boy, That Sing Reactions coming to y'all. My boys, these are my boys, bro. First and foremost, y'all even tell me. This is a uh, Patreon request, I believe, or PayPal. I forgot to put it in the thing. I put it in my watch later, and I didn't mean to do that. I meant to put it in the Patreon or PayPal thing, but it's from one of those. It's a special request. This is Hold On, I'm Coming, Guy Sebastian and Jimmy Barnes. Hold on, I'm coming. Come on. So they about to sing this. And Jimmy Barnes has the grit and power to sing this. This is a Sam and Dave song. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to jump into this. Don't forget my Patreon is in the description. We get exclusive access, early content, and special requests. You can do Cash App. You can do PayPal. Any of that is cool. And also my P.O. Box is in the description. So feel free to send your boy stuff if you would like. Um, These are two of my favorite male singers of all time. Guy Sebastian, Jimmy Barnes. Yeah. So, uh, and yes, I, I am serious. When I say two of my favorite male singers, I can easily run through my favorite male singers list, um, easily, um, because it's, it's, it's much easier than the females for me, but let's jump into this. I got my little waving. This ain't nothing but a screen wiper, but I like to use it when I, when they sing it. Don't do nothing stupid, Jimmy and Gat. Be sad. Be sad. Already, hold on. Let me make sure because for whatever reason, when it's like really loud, it's like muffled. Let me turn this down to 88. And then bring the volume of this up a little more. Did y'all just hear Jimmy Barnes? He just did a, a vocal growl. Come on. <laughs> He got one of the most, first and foremost, <laughs> Jimmy Barnes is a white boy. He has the grittiest sound that I've heard from like a white boy. Like, yeah, and it's amazing. Amazing. That is a compliment, by the way. And it, it's what inspires me to sing. Like I told y'all before, that's the kind of voices that I love. <laughs> I will I'll I'll throw water by the way at everybody looking at this right now. Oh god. Oh my God, Jimmy Barnes is one of the greatest singers I've ever heard in my life. That is my type of singer right there. Now, somebody pointed out, and I think this is the reason why I got this video. This is a re request, obviously. It's because 
I said John Farnham has the higher range. Now, what I was talking about, and I still stand by that, what I'm talking about is the higher belting range. I'm not saying a mix or um, using like your uh, head voice. You know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about belting range. <clears throat> that note right there was crazy though. See, you got to catch me on. <clears throat> John Ford is one of my favorite singers and so is Jimmy Barnes. I don't have them over each other. They, they, they are literally John Farnham has one of the most perfect pitched voices that I've heard. Jimmy Barnes has one of those voices that I actually look up to though. Um, in terms of like that grit and power. People who think that's screaming and don't know what music is. <laughs> By the way, I need a clear version of this. <laughs> I think Jimmy was so into it that he forgot what part they was on. There we go. Come on, guys. First of all, <clears throat> Guy and him are just singing. And Guy, we know Guy has the range, but I think Guy is holding back because he has so much respect <laughs> for Jimmy's voice that he wants it to really, really shine. These notes that Jimmy Barnes is hitting is just in the James Brown era. This is the notes that Wilson Pickett hit. These are the notes that... um. Otis Redding hit. He has one of those voices. He's in that same category as them. Otis Redding, Wilson Pickett, um, Marvin Gaye. Uh, who, who else? Who else? Um, I'm missing a bunch of a bunch of people. What's his name? <clears throat> when the skeletons come out of your closet and it takes you all around the room. Uh, I forgot what that song is called. Listen. <laughs> Come on, Gap. Puff, and here's the thing. He sound better right now than he did years ago to me. Like, Jimmy Barnes' voice... I don't know how old he is here, but come on. Come on, Dad. That's what he did.
transition into that to Tupac. It's just not going to <laughs> Listen. I hate, first and foremost, I hated the audio. Okay? I hated the audio. Um, but I was still able to hear it. But vocally, that was, that was stellar. That was just, it's what I, it's a four chair turn on the voice for me. He would have been picked like, like he would be somebody that I would want to carry to the end on my team because of his kind of voice. His voice is just unbelievable. His voice is unbelievable. Guy Sebastian too. Guy Sebastian has these runs that it's just unbelievable. Like, these dudes are from Australia, bro. They're from Australia. Like I said before, I didn't even know that that was a thing where it's like, man, you got to check out uh, uh, us Aussies, man. We got some of the best singers. Like, I didn't know that was like kind of a thing. I just thought, you know, like, like, but, but it's, it's very factual. Like two of my favorite all time singers, male wise and period come from Australia. That's crazy, man. I loved it. Thank y'all so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, follow me on all my social media platforms. Everything is in the description. Till the next video. Peace.